guys, it's Megan. Welcome back to the vlog channel. Couple things before we get started. Can't find my tripod. So if things are a little bit shaky, I'm doing my best, I promise. Uh, but that's why. I also have a kind of busy day today doing this vlogging thing while also trying to maintain YouTube channels and get ahead for the holidays. Has been quite a lot. So if you guys didn't see the last two videos, they're up on the channel. Like I, I've done like two of these little vlogs now and this is gonna be the third one, which I'm very excited about. And I cannot wait to bring you along with my adventures. First and foremost, we have to find this tripod. <sighs> I'm so sorry. This is like where I like to keep my camera stuff and I have my phone, oh wait, no, wait. Oh yeah, this is my phone tripod, but it kind of looks like maybe it could actually work for a camera tripod. I also have this little thing, which is also maybe, maybe could function as a tripod. I, uh, I don't know. In reality, my camera is right here, so it would just make sense that the tripod would be right here too, right? Well, it's not. There's soup from yesterday that's here, but I'm, I'm not seeing my tripod. I see an old Halloween thing. <laughs> I found it. Amidst pottery. Guys, look at this stuff. Would you believe I made this? Hmm? Hmm? Pretty good. Would you believe I made this? I did. This one, I'm not too proud of, but I made it. And then my favorite thing I made is this mug. So cute. If you guys are new here, I like pottery. Don't have a lot of time to dedicate to it, but I really enjoy it. So you guys read the title. I was supposed to go to California for Everly LeBrant's birthday and I was very, very excited. However, because California is on lockdown, I decided not to go. And I'm really sad that I'm not able to attend her party because I thought it would be super, super fun. But at the end of the day, I just have to do what's responsible and right because Christmas just isn't gonna be the same for a lot of people. And you just really have to think about what's gonna be great for the future of the United States because <laughs> we haven't been taking this virus too seriously. We, as in the United States. I've been doing my part, okay? I wear a mask, I social distance, but I would really like all this to be over soon so that we can all get back to kind of a normal life. Anyway, um, not getting on a plane. I need to go and get a box from like the UPS store or something so I can put together Everly a birthday present because by the time you guys are seeing this, it's gonna be Everly's birthday. Even though I couldn't be there, I wanted to put her together a little present so that she could have something on her birthday. <sighs> I'm like out of breath. It's because I'm hunched over like this. Have you guys seen that meme that's like, I don't, I don't know how to like not curse or like say like this like thing like that Mega Stallion song like Forget being good, I'm a bad girl. I'm sick of mother truckers trying to tell me how to live. I don't know, but then like the people who do the trend do it like this, like, like this. Have you guys seen that? No, okay. Never mind. Okay, I'm on the way to the UPS store. I'm not looking at my camera while I vlog and drive. Well, now I am. So I'm driving and I'm gonna go, but I'm not gonna vlog while I'm driving. I just wanted to let you know that I am indeed in the car holding my camera. And although I love my car, I have not been able to get my Apple CarPlay to work. I feel like I need to take my car in to the dealership and be like, hi, um, ever since I got a new iPhone, Apple CarPlay doesn't work. So I kind of just sit in silence. And then my two months of Sirius XM Premium expired as well. So it's kind of insane insane that I spent this money on a car and I have nothing to listen to except the sound of my own voice. That's why I talk so much. Anyway, see you guys later. <laughs> uh. Can't hit the record button, don't wanna look down. Okay, these boxes, I got a 24 by 24 by 24 and a 25 by 25 by 25 because I wanted to wrap a box and then I wanted to put that box inside of a box to ship. Oh my gosh, guys, I feel so independent. They were so heavy and they were so big because they're folded flat. So they're not just 25, it's like maybe like 70 inches. What's that beep? Hello? Hi, I got the boxes in the car. Oh, uh, a little bean. Yeah, I did it. Uh, it was really hard, but I did it. I love you. Love you. Bye. Mwah. I had a backup plan. I was gonna have Zach come and get me with the boxes <laughs> because I wasn't sure if I was gonna be able to fit them. I mean, what the heck? Guys, I just realized how many masks I have in my car. Look at this. Let me, let me set you up. So this one, this is a paper one. Now, I typed into Amazon the word pink and then these pink masks came up. I bought a hundred of them because the paper ones are just, <sighs> They feel nicer and I feel like I can kind of breathe with them. Like they're, they're official masks. Like this is a this is a real mask, but I just feel like I can breathe a little bit more with them. So I've been using these and like reusing them a little bit, not too much because ew. And that's the thing with the reusable masks. I have so many reusable masks that I use all the time and then they just get dirty, like so dirty. This has lipstick and then it has a freaking bug squash in it because I squashed a bug with it. Like I wasn't even thinking and I haven't been able to get it clean, but anyway, is this one? 
she's cute. We have this Green Bay Packers one, which is Zach's, but um, he left it in here and I could use it sometimes. I have this one. This was my very first reusable mask. I got it back in May and it's done a lot of justice, but the strap is like kind of blown out on it. So it's like I have to double, triple twist this one to make it work. And then this is the last one I have, just a navy. So looking good, it's looking really good. We are about to go to McDonald's to get Zach and myself something to drink because we don't have any drinks in our house. We were thinking about postmating drinks. Go on. Like the world's slowest yellow car in my, go on, come on. I just, I feel like I really deserve a soda today. Like I really deserve a soda today. Uh, ow. Uh, oh my gosh. This box is too big. Here's my dilemma. This box is 24 by 24, bigger than pictured. The only things I have to send is this, this, these, unicorn onesie, socks. That's it. I think it's just too big. I'm like, I'm, uh, uh, well, uh, uh. I have to go back to the store. Look at this, that would be so underwhelming. Obviously I have tons of packing and like stuff to make this more exciting, but like this box is like half empty. So I took some measurements, time to go back to the store. And honestly, I don't wanna go back to the store because it was very embarrassing when I went. Cause whenever I went in, I was like, I need a box about this big. And she said, I don't know what that means. And I was like, uh, mm, just like this big. And then she handed me a tape measure and I kind of measured it. I was like, oh, this big. And then she was like looking at a chart. And she's like, I don't know what you mean. I'm like, <gasps> so it's like, I'm just like feeling like a big stupid inconvenience. And now, I have to go back to the store. On the bright side, I like my outfit. The shirt, guys, the Target shirt was washed before and it held up pretty good. Um, this skirt though, it's kind of wrinkly. It's kind of like skirt, but um, I just pulled it out of the package today. So overall, pretty excited about it. Yesterday, I drove in my car. I went to the store and I bought Zach a Christmas gift. This is really good lighting. I felt so cool because I walked into a store. I bought Zach a Christmas gift that I knew he was gonna love. I felt like such a boss baby, okay? Like, I felt so cool. And now I feel so dumb. Oh my gosh, the school buses. Oh gosh. No, bye. <laughs> kind of big, but it'll, it'll work better than what I had. What is quite important though is I only bought like four of these to pack with. I just thought, like, oh, this is just why I don't get people gifts and mad at it. I have these cellophane things, so maybe I'll scrunch these up and create more body. I've actually fashioned something that I'm quite proud of. So as you guys can see, there's like lights, but it's like a cellophane floor. So I put some of those like fun things down at the bottom and then like I covered it with a layer of cellophane. It does not translate as cute on camera, but I think it's really cool because it fills, it adds body to the bottom of the box and it's kind of pretty. I mean, like I said, not really translating on camera, but here it is guys. I have no doubt that it's like not gonna look like this when they get it. I tried, uh, there, there it is. So I'm about to wrap this the best I can. I know it's gonna get all tossed around when UPS takes it, but eh, we'll see. Well guys, here it is in all of its glory to Everly from Megan. I taped the bow on. This was incredibly hard to wrap. I think she's gonna like it. And I'm gonna put this into this and then I'm gonna have Zach take me back to U -P -U 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 UPS. Hello, it is Saturday and today I am very excited because today is the day that Everly is having her little shindig. I don't wanna say party, that's a pretty loose term, get together. I I'm not really sure what they're doing. I was supposed to go to California for Everly's party and that was going to be very, very exciting but because of the pandemic and everything happening right now, I decided to stay home. Of course, what they're doing is all up to them and I'm sure it's very, very safe because they're all in their bubble already. I live across the country from them. There was just no way that I felt comfortable getting on a plane and being in that airspace, go to California being around them because I put them at risk. I know that once all this is cleared up and things get back to normal, there will be plenty of opportunities to go meet up with the LeBram fam and see them. So I am going to be FaceTiming with Everly and maybe one of her friends, I'm not, I'm not really sure, as well as playing Roblox with them because we just had something really fun planned and it kind of fell through. So that is what I am doing this Saturday. And I am excited for it, but I always get nervous for stuff like this because I never want to let people down. You know what I mean? <laughs> Hi! <laughs> How are you guys doing? Good! Um, so we might have to get your music. Emily is going to uh, play with you on her, um, 
on her technical personal account. I guess it won't be personal after this, but that's what you really want to do. So she's gonna add you from a personal account. Whenever you join a game of Adopt Me, just let me know and I'll uh, click to join you. So Megan, they're always adding in their name. To the yeah, party. no, yeah, I know how it goes. It, it takes yeah. a bit. <laughs> Oh my goodness, guys, I just got finished doing that little FaceTime and I am about to play with the girls. I am so, so excited. Also, I don't know if you guys could tell, but I was like very, very nervous. I always get very nervous in those situations because I always want to like live up to expectations. I don't want to fail anybody. I don't want anyone to think that I'm like actually boring in real life because I kind of am boring in real life. So it's just so sweet. I want to give a huge shout out and thank you to the LeBrand fam for welcoming me into this like little digital birthday party and also inviting me into their home to do like a real birthday party, although I couldn't make it. They are very, very sweet, kind people, and I appreciate them so, so much. If you guys wanna see Everly's reaction to um, all of this, I think that they're putting it in their vlog over on their channel. They'll be linked down below, and Savannah literally sent me the cutest video of Everly opening up her gift, so it was really sweet to see that. I don't know if that reaction is in their vlog as well. I have it, but I don't really feel comfortable like using it and like being like, look, the reaction was so cute, and it made it all super, super worth it. So guys, Savannah, Cole, Ev Posey Zealand. If you guys are watching this, thank you guys so much for allowing me to be a part of Everly's birthday. That was very, very sweet and it really made my day. Thank you so much.